My name is Amr Ihab Kamil, and I'm going to give you a brief about our original research paper submitted to the International Journal of Nanomedicine entitled Curcumin Loaded Nanostructured Lipid Carriers Prepared Using PCO and Olive Oil in Photodynamic Therapy, Development and Application in Breast Cancer Cell Line. This research has been done by Amr Ihab Kamil, Mahfadl, and Lena Luis. First, let me give you a brief introduction about cancer. Cancer is a term given to a collection of disorders that occur when cells disregard proliferation according to the normal cell division rules. Instead, malignant cells develop their own growth signals and mechanisms, leading to uncontrolled growth, proliferation, avoiding cellular death and metastasis. The continuation of this proliferation and invasion of these malignant cells disrupt the normal physiological functions of organs and may have fatal prognosis if left untreated. In fact, almost 90% of cancer-caused death occur due to such invasion in a process called metastasis. Among the different types of cancer, the most frequent cancers in Egypt were liver cancer, breast cancer, and bladder cancer. Now, we're going to give a brief about curcumin, the magical molecule. Curcumin is one of the most commonly used extracts and extensively researched phytochemicals for cancer treatment. It is one of the constituents of turmeric powder derived from the dried rhizomes of Curcuma longa L. Turmeric contains three different analogues of curcumin called curcuminoids. The efficacy of curcumin in combating cancer was found to be higher when used in combination with its analogues. Curcuminoids induce apoptosis in cancer cells through the inhibition and downregulation of several cellular pathways, enzymes, and proteins. However, the limited equisolubility of curcuminoids, photodegradation, poor bioavailability, and rapid metabolism pose a challenge on their applicability. Therefore, in our present study, our aim was to potentiate the anti-cancer activity of curcumin that was carried out by enhancing its capability to penetrate cells through formulating curcumin into nanostructured lipid carriers, NLCs. These prepared NLCs were used for photodynamic therapy on breast cancer cell line. A 3x4 factorial design was used to obtain 12 curcumin NLCs using two factors on different levels. One, the solid lipid type at four levels, namely PCOL, Giliol, Compritol, and Presirol. Two, the solid lipid to liquid lipid ratio at three levels. Olive oil, Tween 80, and Lecithin were chosen as liquid lipid, surfactant, and co-surfactant respectively. Curcumin NLCs were prepared by high shear hot homogenization method. The prepared NLCs were evaluated by determination of particle size, polydispersity index, zeta potential, entrapment efficiency percent, drug loading percent, and in vitro drug release. Optimization was based on the evaluation results using response surface modeling. Optimized formulae were tested for their in vitro release pattern and for dark and photocytotoxic anti-cancer activity on breast cancer cell line in comparison to free curcumin. The results showed that the superiority of NLCs prepared from both PCOL and GLIOL. Uh, response surface modeling helped choosing two optimized formulae, PE3 and GE3. PE3 prepared using PCOL showed enhanced release rates compared to GE3 prepared from GLIOL and also superior cytotoxic anti-cancer activity when compared to both GE3 and free curcumin under both light and dark conditions as per the uh, two illustrations below which shows the um, release pattern and the cell survivor following the cytotoxicity tests. The small mean particle size spherical shape as well as the negative zeta potential enhanced the internalization of the NLCs within cells. Also, modulation and inhibition of P-glycoprotein expression by PCO synergized the cytotoxic activity of curcumin. 
so uh, we concluded that um, curcumin loading in NLC is enhanced its cell penetration and cytotoxic anti-cancer properties both in dark and light conditions.